five rules individually. So this is first rule, and I think like a first and second rule is most common way how to use a colon, and this is one of the very common rule. So like after an independent class, to introduce a list. So maybe yeah, like a so like a for example like a Kelly teaches a variety of classes. Editing, advanced search writing, object speak, and so forth. So, yeah, so if you want to try to use the don't use the column, so like a, if you can like also write like a Kelly teacher variety of class, which are editing, advanced search writing, public speaking, and so forth. But if you choose the column, more easy to understand or simplify. So, and next rule is like a rule second and I think like a, this rule is so complicated especially like a, I also I cannot distinguish like a, this rule and semicolon rule because it's very similar so it is hard to distinguish semicolon and colon this rule because like after an independent class to introduce an explanation expansion or elaboration so like a, for example the business is pretty bad colon that is only thing offers in the market and the budget in team too. This is nice. Just really quick question. Is it just a typo or they are supposed to do it in capital? Which one? The, the um, after a column, mm -hmm. bad, and uh, there is only. Do you capitalize it? Type. Oh, typo. Oh, okay. No, it's not a typo. Either way is actually correct with the colon. You can capitalize or not capitalize. Colons are easy. It's uh, it's either way is fine with colons. Yeah, because I copy to the like, uh, sample sentence from the yeah, oh, okay. like, grammar book. So yeah, yeah. So but yeah, maybe yeah, like as the last class and the last last class, like uh, we talking about colon and uh, comma and sem semicolon and like a uh, sample student asks for, well, in this case, so can I use the semicolon, can I use the like a colon, or can I use the semicolon, it's like a, this way it's very hard to understand, so, so, and rule third is, this is very, maybe minor things, so like a, to introduce the rule or principle, which may begin with a capital letter, for example, the main principle of public speaking is simple, look at the audience, so in this case, if you want to use a, like a look at the audience, so L must use to the capital letter, and it's mentioned to like a principle or a rule. So, and last, uh, for one, it's maybe I think right. You asked the like a, I I remember you asked the I chan for like a, for example, like a if you like a, if you you want to use the comma this time, so like a, you say colon. Like a, and like a, do you wanna go to somewhere or like like a direct uh, direct conclusion? Yeah, direct narration. <laughs> so in this case, if you want to use that column, so you don't use say sales or sales. So like a, you like a personal name or like a someone's name, like a Kelly column direct quotation mark. So so you cannot use a sales or a sales. So to introduce a quotation, not integrate into your sentence and not introduce it by a verb such as say. Like a, so she often used her favorite quotation from a Shakespeare's work, starting is such sweet throw, or that both have this to say about employee behavior. Share your joy, your desk, your phone, and your PC with your colleagues. So don't use the like a say or say. So. And last one is, is additional information, like uh, in salutation, sal salutation, precise time, notation, title, and biblical citation. Mm -hmm. Like uh, if you write a like, mail or letter, so like a, like a dear Takeshi Kageyama column or to column the counselor, or uh, if you check the time, the watch or something, so like uh, between the hour and the minutes, like uh, this is also column, or like a uh, book bibliography, like if you like a paper, so like a book title, 37, column, 31st, from 31st to 35. So also if you want to use uh, this situation, you can also use like a comma. It's also no problem. So 
Both lines you can. Either one is no problem. And last is like a, <laughs> like a chatting or something, like a emoticon. <laughs> like a, this is face, so smile face or a sad face or something. So it's kind of taking it. Or native. Yeah. I read somewhere that colon yeah. save board. So let's move to the next yeah. video. So. Yeah, so <laughs> uh, as Hiroki <laughs> uh, explained, uh, it's kind of easy to understand to use a colon, but sometimes, uh, especially uh, foreign students, uh, as a set English second, second language, is kind of difficult to use a colon uh, correctly. So I, I got an interview with uh, Takeshi Kagami, a Japanese student, and uh, he has a um, license of English teaching, so how do you say, English teacher license. So, Thank <laughs> you.